Alright guys, my mom's in the bathroom right now, blow drying her hair, and we're gonna go scare her. Shh. Ah! <laughs> did you hear me? Yes, I heard you. Are you wait, what did you hear? Turn off the blow dryer. Ah. Went out to lunch, taking my mom. Mom, where are we going? We're going to Red Lobster? What are we doing? I don't want to go to Red Lobster again. What I, do you I got do? sick last time. I don't know. We could go to Applebee's. I don't want to do Applebee's. We could go to the local restaurant. I don't know. We'll figure something out. I don't know. Wayne I really want to do. What's up? Wayne I don't want to do a Wayne House. I don't know. My mom doesn't want to do a uh, Red Lobster. I want to go to Red Lobster. We're going to do something. We're going to figure it out. Then I'm going to go to the gym with Dan. Just another typical day in the life. I'm going to take you guys along with the day. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys soon. All right, so guys, we just got to Olive Garden safe and sound. I think I did a really great job driving. I'm still driving as we're vlogging. <laughs> you, what? you shouldn't drive and vlog, first of all. Oh, but we're, we're good now. We're in the parking lot. All we have yeah. to do is park the car and we're good to go. My mom, my it's mom gets... here. I knew that, mom. I, I thought we were going to Modell's, so I don't know why, but my mom always gets freaked out every time that I drive. I don't understand why. Like, but right now I can understand. I'm vlogging, I'm talking, and I'm driving at the same time. This is probably illegal, but since I'm going two miles an hour in a parking lot, I don't see it as a big deal. But my mom takes everything and then turns it into something that's not. Like, I told her I was going to Cancun with my girlfriend. She's like, you're going to get sun poisoning, you better wear sunscreen. I'm like, mom, no, why do you have to take I everything? Said, bring sunscreen because you could get sun poisoning. It's closer to the equator. No, you said it's closer to the equator. This is exactly what she said. I'm not making this up. Cancun is closer to the equator. If you don't carry sunscreen, you will get sun poisoning and it will ruin your trip. That's exactly how you said right. it. Right. But you I'm say it in this demeaning you. tone. You say it in this tone that just makes I it sound terrible. I don't like you do. I can't imitate your voice. You have a one, yeah, you have you, a one in the kind of voice. But she makes everything suck. I don't understand why. I don't, I don't, I don't make it suck. <laughs> what the hell are you saying? You know what sucks? Forewarning you, and I'm always right. You know why didn't that? you just put? Well, she didn't call me out. I just cut off this lady by accident when I was driving. It was awful. She was freaking out. I tried to get her. I tried to get her reaction on camera. She's so. I think I get it from her. Like I'm bad at reacting to things when I have a camera on me, and I think I get it from her because she has like the best reactions. But then when you put a camera in her face, she just gets like <laughs> all frozen up, and she does like this awkward laugh and smile. No. Like that. See, that's a perfect example right there, guys. We're gonna go on Olive Garden right now. We'll see you guys soon. What are you eating right now? Cream of chicken soup. What'd you just tell me before? You'll have to come back with your friends and try it because it's delicious. Hold on, wait. I, I just want to get you to eat it. I want to take a second. Look up at the camera, mom. Look at my mom's eyes. Are they look beautiful, guys? I want to have eyes like my mom, but that's oh, never gonna so happen. Sweet. Guys, I don't know about you, but I absolutely love the lighting in my room whenever I do vlogs. Every time I turn on the camera and I put the screen up and I look at myself like I'm doing right now, I think, damn, that's some really dope lighting. I don't know why I want to tell you guys that, but it's four o'clock in the afternoon right now. It's about to be. Uh, 4.15 and I need to make a second video of the day. I need to stick to the double upload schedule and I'm thinking about doing a Call of Duty video today. I don't know what I'm going to talk about. I have a lot of different things in my notes. Usually what I do when I, when I start to run thin on ideas like I am right now, whenever I wake up, whatever I'm thinking about in my head, I'll write it down on my phone and then I'll look back at it when I go to make a video. So I'm going to do some sort of a Call of Duty cut com and then I'm going to the gym with Dan at 6 o'clock. I need to take a breath real quick. Hold on guys. Whew, I don't know. I, I go through these weird moods. Like sometimes I'm really happy and energetic. Sometimes I'm just like going with the flow. And right now, I'm I'm kind of happy and energetic. So I think today's gonna be a really good day. I'm gonna finish this Call of Duty video. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet, but I'll let you guys know once it's done. And then um, I, I want to show you guys like behind the scenes of making Call of Duty cut comms. I don't think that no one really does that. So maybe I'll do something like that eventually. Not today though, but. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna do that right now, and then I'm gonna go to the gym with Dan, and then I'm not sure what I'm gonna be doing after that. I gotta pump out a lot of videos because I'm going away to the Hamptons for the week or for like a day or two uh, to hang out with my cousins, and then next week is gonna be crazy. Like, next week is the week. And by the way, I'm not sure how we're announcing the G Fuel winners. I might do a separate video just doing that. So I'll keep you guys updated with everything. I'm gonna go make this video right now, and I'll talk to you guys when it's done. All right, so guys, I'm in the car right now, and I just saw Dan in my rearview mirror. I gotta put this in the vlog. I know I promote Gymshark too much, but he's what do you rocking. Mean? What are you talking about? <laughs> Wait, what happened to Jim Dolphin, dude? What are you talking about? I thought you. I, I'll show. I'm, all right, so you know what? I don't even know what I'm talking about. I'll just show you guys when we're working on the gym. I'll get a clip of Dan doing arms. That's what we're doing today. We're doing some arms. We're gonna do like a fast workout. Um, I feel bad because I made Dan wait like an extra hour for me to finish my video. And I even, I even said that I was like, dude, I feel like a, an ass for making you wait for me. But he's like, it's cool. You know, he's being a good friend. So I appreciate that a lot, Dan. Got you, Doug. I really do appreciate that. We're gonna be working on some arms today. It's already seven o'clock. Our gym closes at eight. 
So that means that there's no way we're gonna be doing arms and basketball. Oh, it's, close at eight. it's a Saturday today. It closes at eight on Sunday. Today's Sunday, actually, isn't it? Or it's Saturday. Saturday. Yeah, it closes at eight o'clock on Saturday as no, well. It yeah, it does. I'm 100 percent positive. I used to work at the gym for two years. I know. It closes at 10 on Saturday. No, no, no. The Farmingdale one I think closes at 10. So what we should do is get our arm workout in, get a protein shake, and then go to the Farmingdale gym and play, bas uh, play some basketball. Alright. And um, also, I can hit up the Phase dudes too because they live like right next to that gym, so we can play ball with them too. We could have them come out and play with us too. I'll text them and I'll see if you're down for that. Cool. Because I'm down for that. Cool. -co -co -co. <laughs> what am I saying right now? But um, yeah, so we're gonna go to the gym. We're gonna hit an arm workout. I'm feeling really good. Um, I really don't want to mention Gymshark, but goddamn, like I just love the apparel so much that I just oh can't. Oh my gosh, here we go. Doug. I know. I, I gotta stop, Dad. Just stop me, dude. Slap me into shape. Just literally slap, don't, don't literally slap me right now. We're gonna swerve into ongoing traffic. And that would make for a pretty good vlog, dude, to be no, honest. Oh, that would be horrible. Getting head on head collision. And I'll make the vlog like right on the second of the impact of the collision where our faces like look all disordered and the airbags come out. Which no, reminds me, that's horrible. there's actually a sign on the bottom right of my car that says I need to get the airbags fixed. So if we did get in a car accident right now, Dan, with me vlogging, the airbags are gonna come out. And basically, what's gonna happen is that. They're gonna be broken. Like our, my airbags in my car are broken. So like basically, we're gonna fucking die. It's gonna literally rip our faces open because there's like metal pieces inside of the airbag or something. Oh, and good if shit, it, good shit. and I'm serious. If the, if the thing exploded, it would literally cut our faces open, and it might, it might actually make us die. So we have a really high chance of dying right now. So I'm gonna cut the vlog on that note. That's a pretty depressing note to cut the vlog on. But I don't want to get an accident, so I'm gonna cut it. You want to say anything, Dan? Um, no. I think you pretty much said it all right there, Doug. But read this really quick, Dan. What does that comment say? Oh. <gasps> No, what did I just do? The middle comment on the phone. Jim Dolphin should be a thing, like if you agree. I'm that like comment it. was posted less than one minute ago, by the way. And it already has four likes. Boom, I just liked it. You know, Jim Dolphin should be a thing. You guys see this? Two hands on the wheel. I'm working Welcome on my design, forward. Doug. I told you, I'm working on the design. We're gonna reveal it soon. It's, a, it's just a work in progress. I just wanna make sure I do it right. I 100% agree with you, Dan, and you know what? I completely think that Jim Dolphin is gonna catch on, especially since you're wearing Jim Shark right now. Yeah, exactly. I think you're totally right. It makes 100% sense, and my logic is just unparalleled. Dude, what are we even saying right now? I don't know. This doesn't make sense. Just but, cut uh, the log, dude. No, stay tuned for Jim Dolphin apparel. Okay. We got young Doug up in here doing some biceps. That's right, that's right. We're doing some biceps. Jim Shark. That work. I, we gotta stop with the gym shark, dude, okay? Oh, I gotta stop with the no, gym no, shark. No, I need to stop too, but you keep on encouraging me. When I see you walking into the gym with the gym shark shirt, it just encourages me to throw it more. And we're doing that right now by just talking about it. But we're doing some biceps, we're doing a really fast type of workout. We got the one dumbbell, we're gonna go over the top, slow contractions, and try to squeeze the bicep as much as possible. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. So here we are with Doug the weirdo about to eat some shrimp. It smells like popcorn chicken. It you looks like sesame chicken. Yeah. Like if you ever had a uh, PF Chang's, the the fried chicken. Yeah. You had you had PF Chang's. Then? Yeah, it's sesame chicken, bro. Yeah. It's, it looks just like that. It smells kind of like that. You're so weird, dude. Oh my god. You know, I'm gonna give you guys a fun fact that you guys didn't know about my mom. Um, when she was growing up, when she was my age, she didn't eat fish, shrimp, nothing. She was completely disgusted at it, just like me. It took her until she was 30 years old to finally try shrimp, and she said it was the best food she's ever had. It's her favorite food. So I've never had shrimp in my entire life. I'm following her footsteps now, and I'm gonna try my first piece of shrimp for you guys. <laughs> Only for the YouTube video. That's it. Oh my. Should I get the sesame piece? Or should I take this one? Doesn't matter, dude. Put, get, does it have sauce on it? No. I'm gonna get the one with the sauce, dude. It actually smells good. Like, I'm freaked out. Like, I'm, I'm tensing up. Like, I even said it before I turned you're, the you're weird, dude. I'm just, tensing up. Just eat it. You're, you're making it a big deal. Ready, guys? My first piece of shrimp ever. If you gag, I'm just gonna be mad at you. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Ready? Ready? <laughs> Don't start. That's not bad. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just natural reaction. Here. I don't know why I do this, dude. I'm just weird reaction. Here. Good? I'm not joking. Yeah, it's good. It's good. It's, hey. I'm just weird. 
Yeah. You look like you're about to transform. <laughs> That's good. It tastes good. I'm just All weird. Right. As, I'm weird as hell. Success? Yeah. All right. Found that. Boom, baby. Hey. So guys, it's Saturday night. It's actually Sunday morning at 12.27 in the morning. And I thought I was going to go see Straight Outta Compton with Dan and my friend Dennis. And apparently they didn't want to go see it. So I've been sitting here on my butt watching videos all day. I actually just watched Rotashaw's My New Lamborghini video. He has this really cool... I'm going to actually show you guys really quick. Uh, this is his car. I'm just going to do like a still frame image of it. This is what this kid drives. He's like 19 years old and he drives a brand new white Lamborghini. That is some goals right there. That is that is straight up from just making YouTube videos every single day. Like that motivates me. That makes me want to push myself harder. That makes me say, hey, when I'm doing a double upload and I don't feel like doing one, I need to keep on doing double uploads because I want to be able to drive a Lamborghini just like him. That's pretty cool. But I'm going to end the vlog on that note. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. A lot of great stuff coming up in this next week, two weeks. My birthday is in four days. When you guys are watching this, no, five days. When you guys are watching this, it'll be five days from now. My 21st birthday. I'm really excited for that. Um, and yeah, hope you guys have a great day. This has been your boy, Doug Setzer Martin. And I'm out, guys. Peace. What is going on, guys? Doug Setzer Martin here. Hope you guys are having a great day. And today, I'm going to be bringing you guys a Black Ops 2 live gameplay commentary. And I've probably only done like five of these tops on my channel in my entire life. And if you guys are looking for some sort of entertaining video, if you guys are looking for some sort of like a challenge video, click that.